1903, when Milton Hershey decided to build the world's largest chocolate factory in the cornfields of Derry Township. This is where it all began. The town grew up around the factory, independently, but benefiting from steady employment and Mr. Hershey's personal legacy of concern for the community and the individual. While things in and around the factory have changed over the years, the taste of milk chocolate is as popular as ever. And the business of making milk chocolate products is as fascinating as ever. Chocolate is a happy flavor. It's America's favorite. When Milton Hershey built his factory, milk chocolate was a delicacy enjoyed primarily by the wealthy. But by developing his own special formulations and manufacturing techniques, he proved that milk chocolate could be made and shipped all over America at a price most people could afford. Choosing this site was no accident. Mr. Hershey knew that to mass produce milk chocolate, he'd need milk and lots of it. So this location was ideal. The rich dairy farms here could produce many thousands of gallons of fresh milk every day. But obviously, it takes more than milk to make milk chocolate. And the factory requires a constant flow of natural ingredients from many different countries around the world. In the lush, tropical growing areas of South and Central America, Africa, and the South Pacific, we find such fruits as coconuts, bananas, pineapple. And we also find vast fields of sugar cane. Unlike most crops, which are grown for their fruit or leaves or roots, it is the cane itself, the stalk, that is important here. Sometimes, within a few miles of the cane fields, other farmers are cultivating very delicate, very special trees, usually planted under taller varieties of trees to protect them from direct sunlight. These are cocoa trees, and their seeds are the basis of all cocoa and chocolate products. The seeds, called cocoa beans, grow within these pods, which are about six to 10 inches in length. The correct scientific name for this fruit is Theobroma cacao, which means food of the gods. The great American, great American, great American chocolate factory. The town, which has a population of under 10,000, was founded by Milton S. Hershey in 1903. It was a most unusual community then, and it is now. For one thing, the educational and cultural facilities are unique. The Milton Hershey School, with its 10,000-acre campus, is a private school, a tuition-free private school for needy boys and girls who don't have adequate care from one of their natural parents. Today, nearly 1,500 students live and study here, carrying on the traditions started by Mr. Hershey back in 1909. The entire state benefits from the medical center, which was built with a grant from the M.S. Hershey Foundation. The complex is owned and operated by Penn State University and provides complete patient care while maintaining extensive research and educational programs. But Hershey isn't all classrooms and laboratories. Hershey Park is a happy experience for every Hershey member of the family. Hershey Park is one of the major theme parks in the East. 